welcome back to the channel, y'all. This episode, I'm going to share with you guys my sin of the day. This is another one of my favorites. Coming from this house of Starter, guys. It's called Starter Elite. Elite, whatever. You know. <laughs> but anyway, this is a really good cologne. Guys, I um, love the smell of this. Citrus vibe that it gives off. Pretty cool baller as well. Check this out. Good spray. Pretty decent spray. Now, y'all know I ordered this pretty much on Amazon. And uh, this was pretty reasonable. Got this for around $9, 10 Y'all know me, I'm a cheapie. I stay within my... $10, $20 dollar range, you know. I don't go too far over. <laughs> I try to find fragrances just reasonable, cheap. Like something like this. Giorgio Red. You know, just a few. Some of the stuff that I wear. I ordered uh, some new colognes. Uh, it's called o Ocean Pacific. Something like that. Pretty reasonable gift, gift set. I order them and review them for you guys. And uh, y'all know how I do. Like I said, when I do colognes, I try to stay within my, <laughs> within the budget range. Anywhere from 10 to maybe $20. And that's about it. After about $20, I might go a little bit higher, but I try to stay within the $20 range. You know, the range of that. After $20, now, the reason why is because I got a lot of other fragrances I might wear. Could be this, um, a little bit of Nautica, you know, could be some roll on oils. I just got so much other stuff that I wear. Several, a lot of oils. I mean, just lots and lots of oils. Different kinds of oils. You know, just so much other stuff I have to wear. So that's why I try to stay. Within that twenty dollar limit, even body sprays, you know, um, just so much stuff. I have to wear Fireman, Blue Dark Ice, you know. So this one here, I get about about two hours of projection, maybe about four to six hours of longevity, something like that. So pretty good cologne. You guys give it a try. It's called Starter Elite. And it's a good one. But hey man, it really is a good one. And um it won't break you. You know, so I don't really talk about colognes that's so high that really ain't nobody really gonna buy them. You know, I try to stay reasonable. Somebody don't mind paying eight to ten dollars, fifteen dollars for them or whatever, you know. Cause like I said, get much over twenty dollars, get a little steep. Cause for me, because I got so many other colognes that I need to wear up. You know, so just keep buying them and buying them and buying them and paying X amount of dollars for them. And ain't wearing the ones I got. Uh, it's kind of crazy. But, uh, yeah, I did order some more because I was curious about the way they smell. So pretty sure they clones or something. But I'll share with you guys. Anyway, it's my center of the day. Hope you guys enjoy. Till next time, y'all hit that subscribe button, man. And I'll hit y'all on the next video. Y'all stay tuned. I got another one coming. Peace out.